Okay, so welcome to our Title I ELA meeting. I am Ms. Price. I am the reading interventionist here at Skyview High School. Please use the QR code that's on the screen or the link that's in the chat to sign in for attendance purposes. I'll give you about two minutes to do that if you haven't done so already. While you complete the attendance form, today's agenda will be Reading Plus, which is now Dreambox Learning. We'll talk about upcoming testing. We'll talk about our ACT bootcamp and we'll talk about our writing lab. So Reading Plus, which is now Dreambox Learning, is a platform that we use for various reasons. All students must fulfill these requirements. Students must log in for 30 to 45 minutes daily. They should aim to complete their lessons scoring 80% or higher, and they are to complete both reading and vocabulary lessons. Some of the benefits of Reading Plus, of course, students can increase their reading level. The goal is to get students to read at 232 words per minute by graduation. Reading Plus can also help students to increase their GPA. Most students complain that they have their elective credits already and they don't need any more electives. But the thing about it is the more electives that you have, and the better you score in your electives as your final grade, the better your GPA will be. GPAs are important if they wanna get into college. As far as elective credit goes, after level C, students can gain up to two and a half credits. Two level ups equals half a credit and four level ups equals one credit. As far as upcoming testing, we have our American Literature EOC. That is the only test we have this year as far as Georgia milestones. The American Literature EOC is 20% of the final grade. It's a requirement for course completion and there will be small group preparation available. Once students finish about 80% of their coursework and practices, they're able to come to me so we can just do a quick review session so they can be better prepared for that assessment and what it's going to require them to do. Access testing is another assessment that we do here at Skyview. So access testing is a test that provides information about students' English language abilities in school. Educators use this information to make decisions about students' education. So access testing pretty much lets us know where your student is as far as what accommodations need to be made for them. So access measures what students know and can do in English in the domains of listening, speaking, reading, and writing. Students do not need to study for the test, but it's super important that they put their best foot forward so that we can know how we can better accommodate them. Our ACT boot camp is gonna start next week. It will be offered on Mondays and Wednesdays during both sessions from 10 to 11 a.m. and 2 to 3 p.m. They'll sign up with me. My sign up roster is on my office door and I'm just ready to get them prepared. ACTs are very important. When it comes to SAT versus ACT, I prefer the ACT. I feel like it's an easier breakdown of what they need to do as far as subject matter. So what that course is going to pretty much offer is practice exams and just drills in each of the subjects. Our writing lab. Our writing lab is to assist students who thrive in smaller group settings. There will be assignments that are 
given out during these sessions and they'll satisfy practices. If we finish one assignment during our time together, I'm gonna to go ahead and put the practice in. I'll put a grade in for that to exempt you from one of your practices. The writing lab will be offered Tuesdays for ninth and 10th grade and Thursdays for 11th and 12th grade during both sessions. Again, the sign up roster will be placed on my door. So at this time, I'd like to thank you for joining me. Do you have any questions for me before we go? You can either write it in the chat if you don't wanna unmute or you can unmute yourself and ask me. But if you have no questions, please go ahead and use this QR code below to complete our survey. Give me one second, Ms. Price. Mm -hmm.